I'll give it a matching name, one millimeter, underscore stainless steel, SS, dash KF for K factor. And let's click OK. Let's define the K factor value at 0 0.42. And let's click Save. Let's return to our sheet metal rule. Now I'm able to select the unfold rule. I'll select the rule I just created. And let's click Save. And we're done. Let's click Done. Then we're going to the Sheet Metal tab. First, let's open the Sheet Metal Defaults window. I'm going to select the one millimeter rule I just created. Stainless steel K factor. And as you see, the unfold rule has updated automatically to the rule I'd selected previously, as well as the material. One more thing, the sheet metal rule we created affects only this document. Let's test it out. Let's create a new document. We'll click on new. And let's select our template and click create. Now finish the sketch. Open sheet metal defaults. As you see, my rule doesn't exist in this document. Let's close this window. Later on, we're going to learn how to save sheet metal rules to your library. And this concludes our video about working with sheet metal rules. We'll see you back in a minute.